Hurricane Spin Broom is advertised as the easy way to sweep. It's a manual broom that works like a street sweeper. But how does it really work? Let's find out. It finally came in the mail. Let's check it out. That's right, today it's the Hurricane Spin Broom. This is the Hurricane Spin Broom. You've probably seen commercials for this or others like it because there's a few of these on the market right now and this is the one I'm doing today. As you can see it has two outer brushes that extend beyond the sides. That's supposedly going to help you with edges. And there's this center brush here which grabs everything and pushes it into a built-in dustbin which you can empty back here. To use the Hurricane Spin Room, you simply run it along the floor like you normally would, applying a little bit of pressure that engages the brushes that will pick up any dirt and debris and put it into the dustpan. I purchased the Hurricane Spin Broom online for about $20. Hurricane Spin Broom is only designed for hard floors. In fact, the instructions right here state it's best on hard surface floors, not for carpeting. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get my floors prepared with a few messes and see how well the Hurricane Spin Broom holds up. All right, the first demonstration, I'm just going to try something easy. We're going to try a little bit of spilled dog food. Let's see how it picks up with those. Again, you always have to put a little bit of a downward motion. And you always want to move it forward. Because you move it backwards, and that's going to happen. You don't want that. Move it forward at all times. Kind of a weird demonstration in the commercial is they pick up a couple of batteries, I guess, because they're saying it's not battery powered. They have a couple of 9 volts. I'm going to try a couple of AAAs and see if I can pick those up. Uh, what do you know? I picked it up. Let's see how it empties out. Interesting. I don't see the batteries in there. Where are the batteries? Interesting, the batteries weren't actually in the dustpan. They were kind of like stuck in, in the brushes somewhere, but it did pick them up. Now I gotta clean up this stuff I just dumped back out again. One thing I'm, I'm noticing with the Hurricane Spin Broom is that you can turn it, you can twist your hand to turn it right or left, but I really had to tighten this one because when I was turning left before, it was just unscrewing. So that's something that I'm having to re-tighten this middle one for some reason because it doesn't want to turn left, it just unscrews it. I have it tight now, so it is working. I have to keep an eye on that one. All right, let's move to something a little bit more elaborate. How about some Cheetos crumbs? Ooh! Not only do we have bigger pieces, we've got some small crumbs right there. That's going to be interesting to see how that picks up. Here, I've got a good area. This has some Cheeto bits, a couple pieces of dry dog food, and some pet hair. So let's see how Hurricane Spin Broom does on this little section. And it's against the baseboard, so we'll see if it picks up uh, against the edge of the wall right there. We've got dog food bits, Cheetos, and a big chunk of pet hair right there. Besides a couple of pieces getting flung forward, it did a pretty good job. Almost all of it's gone. A couple little pieces flew forward, but other than that, um, I think that's pretty acceptable. How about something a little bit more sticky, 
a little bit more challenging like some iceberg lettuce. Let's try that, see what happens. It's been spilled. Hmm, it's weird, I have Cheeto bits coming out of it. All right, here we go. On the iceberg lettuce. This next one was suggested by someone who commented on my Easy Edge sweeper review, and that's baby powder. Let's see how that goes. Okay, we have a pile of baby powder. See what happens right here. All right. Well, I did a pretty good job. We got it all up. You would think the baby powder would be too fine, but Hurricane Spin Broom picked it up. I wouldn't say that it's completely quiet, but there is some sound as you move it along the floor. There are currently five spin brooms marketed out there right now. There's the Easy Edge Sweeper, the Roto Sweep, Hurricane Spin Broom, Turbo Tiger Sweeper, and the Clorox Insta Sweep. After you've used the Hurricane Spin Broom for a while, you start getting some dust and debris in the brush like that. So what you're supposed to do is take this little comb and clean it out. Here's how you do it. Overall, I think on its own merits, the Hurricane Spin Broom does a pretty good job. How does it compare to other spin brooms, like the Easy Edge Sweeper? That's for another video. Please subscribe for more As Seen on TV product reviews from me, James White, with Freakin' Reviews.